Hello Capricorn and welcome to your monthly reading. This is for Capricorn. Capricorn, you can now follow me on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, and Rumble. And I will leave all of those links and all of that information down below in the description box. All right, Capricorn, this is for you. If this resonates with you, please like, share, subscribe, leave me a comment. I would greatly appreciate it. If this does not resonate with you at all, Capricorn, please do check your moon, your rising, and your Venus sign, as this will not resonate with every Capricorn out there. Cross watchers, please keep in mind that some of the energies can be vice versa or interchangeable. So however it resonates with you. This is for Capricorn. This is for Capricorn. What does Capricorn need to know? What does Capricorn need to know? Let's see. Okay. Lots of major arcana here. Major arcana. Oh my god. Ooh, okay. So, um, I see apologies and I see a major shift in the situation. I see a lot of confusion around this. I see a lot of illusion around this. And I see apologies are in order. I'm going to dive deep into the love reading. And for those that are interested, I am going to um, take a look at your career as well after the love reading. So if you would like, stay tuned for that. You got a lot of, of major arcana here. And uh, so that's telling me this is going to be like a make or break conversation, like a make or break apology here. Some of you may be even thinking about like divorce or a legal separation. That's for some of you, not all of you. But this is going to be a major decision. And temperance here. Find your balance before making this decision. And I do feel reconnection here. Of course, that's going to be up to you. You are the one that's truly in control here. So keep that in mind. And you are in control of the way the situation is going to play out. But it's kind of now or never. This is it. This is it. So find your balance before making this huge decision. I do see apologies here. I do see a conversation. However, I do see two forms of uh, communication here. I see an apology coming towards you, an emotional message. I see you speaking to that person, but they may not like what you have to say. It could be, you know, you could come through as a little angrier because you feel injustice here. You feel like you've been done wrong. You feel like there was illusion. Everything got mixed up. Emotions are all over the place. And um, I feel the person you are dealing with is wishing to, you know, get, get back to happiness with you if it is a possibility. But this conversation needs to happen so that either you work it out or you don't. It's, it's, either yes or no at the at this moment it's very it's like a critical moment in this situation so you're very guarded very guarded with your heart you're being very greedy with your emotions and in in a very dominant role at this point they're not going to let this go anytime soon this is known as the miser of the tarot could be some Money worry around this as well, but holding back. You're really holding back and you've got a shield up on your heart. So 
You're keeping a lot of things to yourself, a lot of your thoughts to yourself, a lot of your emotions to yourself. But when this, yet another major arcana here, when this conversation happens, it's going to be like, lay it all on the line. It's all going to come out. But you feel like things are being kept from you. Pisces energy here. So... This person that you're dealing with is wishing to get back to this happy space with you. Commitment here, family here, um, partnership here, happiness here. This is one of the happier cards in the tarot. Then we have the star card here. They are wishing to get back to good. They want everything to balance. This star card is a very healing energy. You could be dealing with an Aquarius. So... That is what they're wishing. However, you are the one that's in control of the decisions that are going to be made here. This is at the root of this reading. Cancerian energy here. So you're the one that is in control. Are we going to go left? Are we going to go right? Is it going to be a yes? Is it going to be a no? Illusion. A lot of mixed emotions. It, it's just been so confusing here. Seven of Cups. And you, it's like the, the truth needs to happen. Um, apologies most definitely need to happen. You could be dealing with a Leo or somebody with strong Leo in their chart. Strength card here. So you, you're holding back. You're keeping a lot inside. Um... And being, I don't want to say stubborn, but it's, it's like you've put your foot down in a, in a certain situation. And you're holding back and you're strong enough to handle this. You are. When this person does come back around with these apologies, Libra energy here. Be dealing with a Libra. There's somebody with Libra in their chart. But um, the apology is needed. The conversation is needed. And you need, you know, it needs to happen. Here, here you are now. You could be dealing with an Aries or somebody with strong Aries in their chart. But like I said, you're the one that's in control. You're the one that's going to direct how this story is going to go after this conversation. But you're not moving on this. They have to be generous to you. They have to come to you. Again, with the balance. They want to balance things. They want to heal things. Six of Pentacles. So do you or don't you? You're pissed. You're pissed. So here comes the apology. It's like, do I accept this? Do I not? You're really going to have to think things through and, and make sure that this illusion... That you're getting the whole truth and nothing but the truth, basically. Four of Cups here. So like I said, incoming, incoming messages, incoming messages, but two different languages going on here. They're more emotional, more vulnerable. You're fired up. More passionate. Page of Wands here. But there will be a conversation. And it is much needed. But here you are. Curious, but keeping your hands to yourself, not being um, self-sacrificing to this individual anymore. They're going to have to figure it out. And um, if you don't like what, what is being said to you, um, it's not going to go well. Please clarify the page of wands for Capricorn. Please clarify... The Page of Wands for Capricorn. Let's see. It's a lot of drama, and you're going to have to really think things through. Go back. It's You're up and down about it. Your emotions are a little all over the place. But, like I said before, keep in mind that you're the one that's truly in control here. And there's going to be maybe some negotiating going on. 
could be some drama here. Like I said, two different languages going on and you're the one that's really fired up here. So what to do, what to do. Really think things through here before you make this decision because it's kind of the final decision. Let's pull some romance angel cards here and see what we can see for Capricorn. This is for Capricorn. What does Capricorn need to know? What does Capricorn need to know? We have true love. This is the romance of a lifetime and healing family issues. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. I feel like the person that you're dealing with, their issues go back a long, long way. And in order to heal the situation with you, they're going to have to heal a lot of aspects of themselves. And can things work out with this true love? Yeah, it can. But it's going to be entirely up to you. And it's, it's going to be a make or break conversation. Like the final decision here. They may have to agree to like some counseling for some of you. Alright, so let's take a look at your career here, Capricorn. I see some success coming in for you. I see a lot of doors opening up for you and you're like, oh my, I mean, which direction do I take, right? So the choice is yours, but you're going to move forward towards your victory, okay? And your happiness and your wish fulfillment here. So many many doors opening up to you but again it is a huge decision it's it's you know it's going to cause a great change worried about the unknown right and i feel like you're going to take your time and make this decision but you know money could be tight right now um but all these doors opening up to you capricorn is going to loosen up loosen up that money a little bit and you've got communication back and forth here communication back and forth negotiation this is you're worried that you're not going to be the one that is chosen because it's like a highly comp competitive road that you're going to go down but i do see victory being yours i do see victory being yours I see the offer being made to you and I see, you know, you, you don't know if it will be, if it will be offered to you. It's a bit of a mystery, but you're, you're going for it anyway. And you have the courage to do this. And it's like the odds are in your favor here, Capricorn. Okay. The odds are in your favor. Justice is yours. The decision will be yours and um highly competitive a bit of a like i don't know if i'm gonna get it but you get it and um it's it is your wish fulfillment it is your cup of jewels all right capricorn that's what's going on i hope that resonates with some of you most of you all of you like i said at the beginning of the video you can now follow me on instagram facebook twitter TikTok, and rumble i'll leave those links down below in the description box. You guys have a beautiful day and a great week, and I will talk to you soon. Take care, and God bless.